So NASCAR is a lot more complicated than most people realize. We're gonna do a little NASCAR for dummies. What better three dummies than us to go all the way behind the scenes and see what's happening in the pits, in the stands, and everywhere else in between at the Daytona 500. They see me rolling, they hating. It's beautiful. Oh. Yeah. It's the Daytona 500. Welcome to Barstool Does Daytona. This is my first time at the Daytona 500. We got NASCAR racer. Corey LaJoy with us. I love it. I didn't know what to expect. I really had no idea, but I would come back to one of these in a heartbeat. So Sam, like, why, why did you, like, you look in the mirror and you said, I'm pretty, I gotta put my face on my car. Absolutely not. Right. Right, like, really? I'm not, I would not, have been like, oh, no, no. yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm not, I was not excited about my face running around on the car for the 500. What do the other drivers think? Or you don't, I don't care? Know. I don't really care. Okay, it's right. what it is now. Yeah. So you gotta keep going that way. So go this way one time. And now go that way. Okay. You're good. You're doing all right. Rookies. Even though it's super early in the morning, these guys are getting tired already. Dad. Let's see. Yeah, there you go. Whoa! <laughs> Get it real low like this. And then you just pop it out. Stick it on. Pop it on, baby. Yeah. So you're the head of the pit crew here, right? Yeah. So it's kind of like being. Well, like, I'm not like the head. I mean, we all have You heard our... it here first. He thinks he's the best crew chief on not... the pick. We got a crew chief yeah. and we got five guys who are all equal on the pick. If your driver's fighting another driver, are you looking for the equal guy oh, on the coming. other crew? Oh, yeah. We're coming, baby. Well, you go for we're the coming. other crew chief. We got yeah. our guys back. Austin Dillon won last year, and the pick crew, the team, is a huge part of that. He probably walks around with a little bit of big dick energy. Do you guys uh, also, when you're coming a lot, in? A lot of BDE on this team. Yeah. We all got ass tattoos. That was my third Perfect. one. You want to see? Yeah, I do. Ask that too. <laughs> Ask that. Nice. Oh, oh, nice. You don't have to know too much about racing to know that the really important thing is the, the color of the car and the way it looks. Red equals fast, so this one's probably going to do pretty well. I like this one. Big Froyo guy. Everybody knows that. I like Froyo. Yeah, we're going to get in with the Froyo guy. See what his favorite flavor is. If it's not birthday cake, I'm going to boo him. What's your favorite flavor of Froyo? Uh, latte. What's your favorite flavor of Birthday cake. What? I have to ask, are you a little bummed that this isn't a convertible race? Uh, definitely not. I, I like having the roof on the car. I don't know, because I feel like your flow would be crushing it out there. Is it true that you could take a screen door, put a little flex tape on it, and turn it into a canoe? Phil Swift says it is, so it's got to be true, right? Weird flex tape, but OK. <laughs> One of these things is not like the other. That's a truck. Not fooling me, that's a truck. Yeah, all right, thank you. You got it back. Thank you. Yes, sir, you got it, got it. <laughs> I mean, like, they're they're asking pictures, auto, like, no one's asking me for my autograph. This is bullshit. All right, so we're here with Kurt Busch. Kurt's got a new initiative that he's going on with race cars. Big veteran guy, right? Thank you, yeah. It's called the KB100. 100. 100 tickets for every race this year. It's just a, a way for me to say thanks. We uh, appreciate that. Yeah, I think that's, that's awesome. a great initiative. So really it's an easy way that. to find it with vettics.org. Okay. So, yeah. All right, so they're trying to clear the track. Everything's getting ready to go. Wives are his and husbands. Husbands are kissing wives. They're getting ready to start racing. If you ain't rubbing, you ain't racing, and we're about to be racing, boys. 200 miles an hour, the goal? 69 to real goal. 69 to real goal. They're about to come around the bend, boys. Here we go! They took these little old tires and they just changed out. So that what they're doing is taking all kinds of measurements. They're getting the exact pounds it's in, how much rubber they lost, how hot the tires are. Blowing my mind. I just thought they take these, throw them out, put on some new ones and get going again. Every little thing is so precise. It's amazing. Here comes the forecast. Here comes the intensity like an orgasm folks i feel it in my britches all right so after doing a little pit crew action and getting down there on the track we decided because we're fancy we decided to come hang out with austin dylan at his rv 
Hey. So what uh, took you so long? Yeah. Hey, we're out of beer. Do you we're want to make a beer, run? Buddy. See, seen my brother's ass I saw? Oh, yeah. I couldn't help but notice a lot of the other drivers have their RVs in a special section, but you're a man of the people. You're out here. Well, now that you've oh, yeah. won the Daytona 500, do you like to go undercover and see your fans and see everybody? Uh... We cruise to the infield quite a bit. They what makes a good go. infield? The party. Yeah. Yeah. For it sure. is. That is weird thinking about it. Like right now that you're like in the middle of the track. Like we're with Jesse. He is a NASCAR driver in the Truck Series. He's also a naval officer who played football at the academy. So we're about to go out on the track at Daytona International Speedway. We're gonna um, see how they like the high banks of Daytona International Speedway. How fast are we gonna go? We're going at least 100. Maybe I can sneak in a little bit faster than that. We'll see. All right. The cup cars that race here today, they're gonna be going about 200. Only two of us can ride, so rock, paper, scissors. One, two, three, two. Me and, me and Kate. Damn no, it. I feel like you should go, Jasper. Nope, that's the rules. I'm a man of integrity. You ready? Yeah, yep. let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like the first time you got on this track? It was freaking awesome. I'm going to get you a little bit close to the wall up here. OK. Hold up there so you can you feel the G-forces and stuff next to the wall. So they're up here, and they're going twice this speed right here that we're going That's right now. And these guys are right up against the wall. They are racing hard. They're bumper to bumper. They're going faster than this right here. They're bumping each other, all that stuff. That was intense. Yeah, I get why you're into it. Yeah, I get it. Checks out. It's pretty fucking cool. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. That's fast. Wow. Unbelievable. All right, so we've been in the pit crew. We've done the live show. We've done everything. The only thing that we have left at the Daytona 500 is the actual damn 500 miles. Until then, we will see you in Charlotte.